Guys, welcome to my channel Electronic Secret. Today, video is about LED LCD TV basic voltages required for display or picture. I have divided this video into two parts, viewers, so you can easily troubleshoot and fix the problem of no display or picture blur or bars on the screens and faults like this. So, don't skip any part and watch the video completely. Now, viewers, the first part is I am telling is the Types and details of voltages and problems and faults caused by these voltages if missing. So the basic voltages required for picture and display are of six types. These six voltages are if present then your picture will be okay. Otherwise you have a white display or a bars on the screen or a black screen and faults like this. So first voltage is V in. It is 12 volt we were second is VCC it is 3.3 volt third voltage required for picture is VGL it is about minus 5 volt to minus 8 volt depends upon models fourth voltage is VGH it should be between 20 volt and 30 volt maximum this voltage is about 25 27 volt fifth voltage we were is VDD or VAA this is equal to 15 volts. Six voltage required for picture or display is HVDD or VCOM. It is almost the half of VDD. It should be 7 volt or 7.5 volt. So if these voltages are present, colors are okay, display is okay, no blur screen, no bars on the screen. But if any one of these voltages is missing, any one of these voltages is missing, your picture and display would be like this. It should be bars on the screen. It should be display. It should be a white display or a black screen or a blurred picture. So it is important to know the function of these voltage and how to check these voltage. The second part of my video is how to check test T con and scalar DC to DC voltages and their testing points. We were some LCD LED TV may have T con boards. This is a T con board. You can see that it have a DC to DC IC and some may have not. The LED TV which have not T on board have scalar PCB like this and the DC to DC IC is located on this scalar PCB. But the checking procedure is same. You can see that every T con and scalar PCB have testing points. It has V in, VGH, VGL, VCC. This is VGH point. This is VGL and this is VCC. Set your meter to DC to DC range and ground the negative probe. Now the first voltage we will check is V in. You can see that it is 12 volt. It is okay with this. The second voltage we will check is VGL. Here is the testing point. VGL should be minus 5 volt. You can see that. Third voltage is Weaver's VGH. Here is the testing point of VGH. It is 26.95 volt. It is okay. Next voltage is VDD Weaver's. Here is its testing point. It is 15.5 volt. It is okay. Next voltage is HVDD. It is 7.73 volt. It is okay, Weaver's. The next voltage we have to check is VCC, it is 3.3 volt. You can see, you have seen that all the voltages are okay. And this is the method to check the T cone voltages or scalar PC voltage. So if these R voltages are okay, your picture will be fine. And if any one of these voltage is missing, your picture will be bad, white display, black display, bars on the screens, colors bars on the screen and things like that. So this is the video for today. If you have enjoyed it, kindly like it and subscribe my channel. Thanks for this.